welcome to Crafting with Jane. It's a Christmas one this time and I thought I would show you my Christmas decorations and things that I've got up and um, hope you'll enjoy them. So this is my tree. Let's walk in slowly. You have to excuse it being a little bit probably wobbly because I'm not probably the straightest at this but let's take a look at the top of the tree. So the top of the tree has got the fairy which I made um beautiful if you look back on a video i think a year ago you'll see the fairy and then coming down there's all sorts of little decorations and things on there i tend to keep it sort of two tone um there's some things that i've made there's obviously a hair on there because i absolutely love hairs it's given to me as a birthday present so it's very new then we have this lovely ornament here which I made last year, which is a fir cone. Um, and again, you can probably see on there, if I sort of turn it up a bit, um, it's, it's made, uh, again, I think I showed you a video a year ago of that, but that comes out on the tree. This is one of the stars that I made this year. Um, and again, it's a very different sort of star. It's a rather nice star. So if you have a look back on a couple of videos, you'll see that one. Um, I thought that you would like that and then if I go round on the other side carefully you can see that I think I've got um, I've got another one of those ornaments and there is another um, little star around the other side but that's basically the tree I can't get it all on in there but you get an idea of, of how pretty it is and how it's decorated in just sort of two tones of colours. So I have the silver with all the tinsel, I have white lights on the tree and then I have um, uh, sort of coppery colours um, going through or, or sort of pinky hues which I think look rather pretty and a little bit of gold. So then I'm going to go on to my table and I've got a really rather lovely um, candle that was given to me for my birthday because my birthday is December so I've got that it smells absolutely delicious it's got um, what has it got it's got um, it's Christmas spice which is lovely and then there's my vintage which I will turn around and take let me just move this out of the way and you can see my snow globe. It's a very vintage snow globe, but it's a lovely little snowman Christmas scene. And I've got two little, if you look on here, there's two little gnomes saying Merry Christmas on there. Those were actually given to me um, by one of my subscribers who's become a good friend, who sent me all sorts of lovely things um, for Christmas. So that was a, a, an, an advent. So let me go on to my... Um, desk and I've just got over my little bureau I've got a garland wreath on there um, and there's another little hair on there because as you know I love hairs so um, I think that's probably just turning round sorry going too fast for you um, but I have got one thing I wanted to show you this here comes out every Christmas and it is some little gonk gnomes that I made from felting. And then the wreath is actually um, an old root. If I come close, you can probably see the root. Um, it, it was a root which I sprayed with um, silver and white. And then I put some ribbons on and then made the little gonks and it hangs up as a little wreath in on the room, which I think is rather pretty. I've also got my, which I made a long time ago, which I will show you. I've got my craft box and that I will probably show you how to make it one day. This is what I keep all my cards in. It's a very big size um, and I made it a long time ago, but, um, but it's quite pretty. So let me just turn round and I'm going to turn you, hopefully. Can I turn you round the other way? I don't know whether I can. No, I'm going to have to walk you round. So I'm going to try and walk you very slowly. That's part of my garden, uh, my Christmas tree again. And then I'm just going to walk you through 
into the front room, so through my kitchen. Quite slowly, I've got the lights on because at this time of year you don't get very good light. And then through into my front room where you can see I'm going to turn the lights on because it's a bit dark. So let me turn my twinkly lights on for you. And you can see I've got up in this corner, which is very bright, I've got a beautiful star, which um, the star is, it's probably almost too bright to see, it's a metal star. And then I've got beautiful lights all the way down on there, hanging like the shooting star. And then my fireplace, I have got another wreath with some homemade decorations and things on there. So let's have a look at those a little bit more closely. So I've got a felted snowman. There's hairs everywhere because you know I absolutely adore hairs. So this is a little felted snowman that I made. Really rather pleased with him with his lovely little face. Then I've got a little angel in the centre, um, which I love. And then I've got a little snow globe um, again with a little felted mouse um, and his lantern singing the carols which again I felted and made and then at the corner of my picture there's a little tiny teddy bear which again I made he's very tiny he's probably only a couple of inches high but I really like making him and then if we move on to my shelf I've got a lovely um, lantern, a Noel, a little Christmas tree, and then a um, Christmas train advent calendar. And then there's a little, this has got the name of my little dog Luna on. And then if we go up a shelf, so if I take you up carefully onto the second shelf, I've got um, a lovely, um, it's made out of um, cast iron piece symbol with again little hanging things off of there um, for Christmas, which I think is quite pretty. And I think that's just about it. On my fireplace, I've got my wood burning stove, but in front I've got some beautiful Christmas flowers um, because I was lucky enough to be given some beautiful flowers for my birthday and they're lasting absolutely beautifully. They're, they're Christmas which are lovely, um, so berries and roses and things and I think they are absolutely lovely. Um, going round into this little corner, which I haven't done, this table is absolutely covered in birthday cards on one side, Christmas cards on the other side and then my um, my sort of vases that I have on the floor I've got a little snowman in front and then what I do is I just to give it a little festive nod is just put some bells on the front of them so I've got the um so that they they're about all year long because they match with my decor but I just put those little bells on which just gives it another little nod so let's go back through onto the beautiful festive fireplace so you can see and I hope you enjoyed the, the view of all the things that I've got, um, Christmassy and how I sort of decorate things. Hope you have a wonderful Christmas and a very peaceful new year. Um, thank you everybody for all my subscribers this year, <clears throat> old and new. People have been with me right from the beginning. People who've joined along the way. People who are just watching this now, hopefully you'll join. And um, as I say, please stay safe and well. Please be kind and look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye bye.